What's the crack? You're watching the Lab TV. I'm here with Thomas from Fire and Water, and I'm here with Mark Daly from Mark Daly. Uh, what's the crack? So, boys, how are you? That's the bad now. Yeah, that's the job. Uh, Thomas, you uh, so you you went on tour with Jeff Lasher. What was that like? Unbelievable. Completely changed the way I look at how to perform music and the way they do it is so natural. Watching yeah. them. Uh, even preparing for a gig, they might be loosey goosey having a couple of drinks, whatever. But the second they get on stage, they're 100% professional. So it taught me a few things, you know what I mean? What was the biggest lesson? The biggest lesson, um, I'd say that the illusion of whatever you're putting on is the reality of what the, the crowd are taking. <clears throat> so, like, they put months and months into preparation and they, they prepared everything very, very. Uh, what was said, everything was tight when they performed, you know, from walk-ons and walk-offs and ev everything. Oh, wow. So it's not just a matter of uh, performing live, it's the whole, they, they perform the show as if it's... As uh, in the whole show, everything. Yeah, yeah. Everything. Yeah, everything. Just, you know. I seen that with the rubber bandits, man. I went to see them, right? And from the beginning, I love them. to the middle, to the end, everything was choreographed. Yeah. Every little thing, I was like... It's like this, this is absolutely... Amazing and inspiring. Like it's just the the level of thought. It's like okay, I have to do the same thing with my own shorts. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Mark, I wanna <coughs> ask you. So you're are you're going on this tour, or is it England? Some of the dates, yeah, the UK and Ireland dates, yeah. And you were there last year as well, yeah, or the year before? Uh, the year before. The year before. Yeah. And how was that for you? Amazing. Yeah. Life changing. Um, unbelievable experience. And as Tomas was saying, the professionalism, it's it's contagious. There was, there was a, um, Rudy Sarzo, who played with Ozzy Osbourne and White Snake and all these. Watching that man who's like, he must be in his 60s, and that guy warming up on the tour bus every day. You know, that guy is just ultimate professional, and all the guys are like that, and it's it's contagious. I see that level of professionalism, and uh, then I was like, I, I want to be like that. So, like, you, you lose all those things that you see in movies. Of how like you know you watch Almost Famous and you watch all these like things and you go, oh that's how it is. But then you go on tour and you go, oh no, this is hard work yeah, and, and, <laughs> and you get shocked at first, but um, then you get just it's as I said contagious and you, you just love it and that's what I'm addicted to. It's my drug. And the amount of Parma ham that's always available is ridiculous as well. <laughs> Turn over the table. <laughs> you could say you're going ham, by. Yeah, <laughs> You know what? It's good. It's good to hear that as well. That like when you're around the right energy, it inspires you in the right way. Big time. And I can see that in the in the two of you. I mean, in yourself, you're always working, banging out songs, always doing something, always somewhere, keeping busy. And the the vibe off is like you're in that flow of I'm doing and I'm here. Yeah. And anytime I've seen you perform, it's been a religious experience. So. Thank you. Vice versa as well, you're by on, the way. The stuff you done with the kids is unbelievable too. Nice no, so one, <coughs> You're on that. You're on that level, like, and I've just got respect for that. Is pretty much what I'm saying. Like, so much. Vice versa. Just keep it up as well. It's classic. Like. And and yourself, Mark. I haven't seen you perform yet, but I'm gonna stay tonight. Debut one tonight. I'm gonna see it tonight. You won't be. It's my first one with the band. You tonight. won't be disappointed anyway. Is some of the most electric frontman vibe I've ever seen as well. <laughs> well, you look like a decent frontman, but thank you very much. You've got you've got the the charisma as well, like you know. And the mustache. And that goes that way. I remember <laughs> I, I remember seeing you on the street one day before I knew who you were. I was like, that thing is is something because I can feel it off. And yeah, it's something there, like just the <laughs> the charisma is there. Nice. And then I uh, I seen you at the open mic and you were playing. I was like. Ah, oh, okay, I get it now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is his life. But also as well, to see what you're manifesting in your life, right? Is the, the musicians around you and the support and the new single and all the attention that it's getting. Yeah. It totally shows me that you're in a place where you're ready to receive now. I, I visualised the whole thing. Everything that's happened tonight, I visualised a live band. Yeah. yeah. We've, we've or, or four, four or five o'clock in the morning drinking cans and talking about it and we made, we made it happen. Um, I'm a big, big fan of like setting goals. Um, I listen to motivation and speeches and stuff. Um, Same page, man. Les, Les, Les Brown, Les Brown, Eric Thomas. Um, I really, really love those guys. They're Tony just, Robbins. Tony Robbins. I've listened to Tony Robbins a lot as well. Um, Donald Trump. <laughs> oh yeah, he's on mine. The number one. I, um, <laughs> the, the wall in my bedroom is covered in quotes and stuff to reprogram myself. And re oh yeah. To train my brain in a different sense. Yeah. Any so, time I kind of fall off the track of it, I 
Les Brown is the man. I mean, just every time I listen to him, it's like... Whew. So we, as I said, we, we made all this happen tonight by just talking about it, thinking about it, visualizing it. And I was like, I was determined to do an EP. And I, at the time it was like, how is that possible? Got the EP done and then I was like, I want to perform it with the band. And I want to go on tour with it. And it's all happening now. This cla if there's a lesson for anybody watching out there is if whatever it is that you want to do in your life, put your attention on it, focus on it, make it become your life. And don't be afraid of it. If you are afraid of it, figure out why and move past it. And then if you tell your parents and they start giving out to you, go, hey, that's your shape, not my shape. <laughs> and just follow it with all your heart and you can do it, but And these two boys and Jeff himself are a fine example of what you can achieve when you follow your dream and your heart. You're all class, lads. Thank you very much. As are you, Baba. Thank you. Any final message for, for the audience? Life is class. Oh, you tell them. It is class when there's Sharit's on. You can't bet it, but. That's it, can't be bet. <laughs> Thank you, boys. Thank you very Thanks. much. Cheers. No one can prepare you for all this heartache. Once I could.